the mini cow clip has reached more people. <laughs> I am getting. I told you. I am getting Oops, more sorry. messages from people about the mini cow clip. It's fucking bananas. Woo, mini cow train. And most people are like, you know, those are just baby cows. They're not mini. No, but there's are, also a mini cow. Yes, but also you, most of the mini cows have some sort of growth defect. Yeah. Or you could get a cow with Down syndrome. That doesn't mean it has mini cow. No, but they're 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 smaller or dwarfism. That's what I meant. Yeah, two different things. Sorry about that. Do cows get Down syndrome? Probably. I've seen like a, I've seen a cat with Down syndrome. A cat? Yeah. There are animals with the syndrome. Google, Google. Google. Are there? Google. Do pets get Down syndrome? Do animals get Down syndrome? I don't. I can't remember. I was about to say I can't remember seeing one, but I don't know if they look different. Do you know what I mean? And how would you know if your cow had Down syndrome? Technically, dogs and pets. Or te this says dogs. Technically, dogs cannot get or have Down syndrome. However, they can have conditions that present similarly. Dogs may also inherit other genetic disorders or chromosome abnorm abnormalities, but research does not indicate that dogs can have Down syndrome as people can. What about other animals? Do animals get Down syndrome? While some wild animals can suffer from su similar cr chromosomal defects, they cannot have Down syndrome as it is specific to humans. There have been several cases where animals have similar symptoms to Down syndrome and people mistakenly assume it's the cause. Do me a favor now. Now Google animal Down syndrome images. Animal Down. I wonder if the it, if it if the animals that are affected with whatever they're affected by look different. Yes, look different. They do. They do. Yeah. This is a this is a tiger with that. Get the <laughs> fuck out of here. <laughs> What? Let me see that. Honestly, first of all, that looks like a tiger from Harry Potter. Find me another one. The same this one is, or, by the way, this is an orangutan. Animals with Down syndrome is not a rabbit hole. I thought we were going down on this podcast. This is an orangutan. Just looks like an orangutan. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. Albino gorilla. Okay, but that the albino gorilla doesn't mean Down syndrome, does it? Yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> that, but that that this is fascinating to me. It's fascinating. <laughs> Look at these giraffes. Come on. <laughs> the one with his tongue out. Get the fuck Poor. out of here. By the way, that's a long ass tongue, man. Dude, giraffes have super long tongues. You don't know that? Yeah, I think I do. Have you ever fed a giraffe? Yeah, at the at the LA Zoo. There's a lion. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see that picture again. <laughs> I was gonna show. I'm seeing that picture. He can join it on the fun. That that photo is crazy. Yo, this looks <laughs> straight up like a crackhead. This looks like. I feel like we should put that on a t-shirt and this be like, looks be like, like and, crackhead lion. I want to. I want to put it on a t-shirt and the caption is gonna say, "This is how fucked up I want to be tonight." Dude, this <laughs> looks like four day bender. Somebody just asked me, "Hey, you want hit that?" Do I hit that again? And I'm like, yo, dude, this, will you send that to me? Yeah, I'll send it to you.